Good morning, my sunshine. Guess what day it is? <sighs> hmm, I don't know, Mom. What day is it? Oh, honey, come on! It's your 16th birthday! Oh, whoopee. <sighs> That's right. My little girl becomes a woman today. Mom, Dad, we've talked about this. I like the way I look. Honey, I know you're nervous about the change, but your father and I went through it when we were 16, and look at us. That's right. The change made us so much happier. I mean, me and your mother might have never met had we not gone through with it. Not went through with it? We don't even have a choice. Why should I change just because the government says so? Honey. The government initiated the change as a way to make life better. Now every pet has the chance to be a perfect five. Well, shouldn't pets be taught to accept themselves for who they are and what they look like? Not change themselves to fit society's image of a perfect pet? But before pets had the opportunity to go through the change, pets who weren't born with perfect looks were bullied. The change has fixed that. <laughs> I'm in high school, and I can definitely tell you bullying hasn't stopped. And what about mental health? Harley, please don't ruin this special day. Your father and I have dreams of this day. The day our young daughter becomes a beautiful young woman. Yeah, the day society forces me to change. Whatever, Mom. I just wish... I bought you this special outfit for this special day. Here, put it on and meet us downstairs. Come on, honey. Oh, my little girl. Okay. Oh, honey. Oh, honey. That outfit. It's going to look so good on you after your change. Oh, don't you just love it? Um, yeah, Mom, I love it. But, ah, yay, I knew you would love it, honey. Oh. Harley, I have to get to work, so if you want a ride, we need to leave soon. I'm going in early so I can get home to see my beautiful girl after her change. Oh, um, yeah, Dad, I'm ready. Oh, Harley, don't forget your appointment is at 3.30 right after school. You'll need to catch the bus and ride it down two blocks to the change institution. Ah, I'm so excited. <sighs> yeah. Wouldn't want to miss it. Harley! Huh? Harley! Oh my dog, happy birthday, Harley! I cannot believe you're getting the change. Like, it's so exciting. On a scale of 1 to 10, how excited are you? Wow, um, okay, hi to you guys too. And I've told you before, I don't agree with the change. Why can't pets just be happy with themselves? <laughs> oh, Harley, you're like so funny sometimes. But who wouldn't want the chance to be perfect? I don't... I'm sure you're just a little nervous. I was too, but after, I felt so much better about myself. I mean, look how gorgeous I am. But do you really feel better about yourself? <laughs> um, well, of course. I mean, that's what the change is for, right? Um, yeah, I'm sure you guys are right. Well, I'm gonna get to class. Um, I'll see y'all at lunch. Yeah, see ya! 
let's talk about what look you're gonna go for at your appointment. Um, yeah, sure. Thank you. Hello, welcome to the Change Institution, here to make pets the best they can be. How may I help you become a better pet today? Um, hi, I have an appointment for 3.30. Please state your first and last name so that I can check you in. Harley Pierce. Harley Pierce has an appointment at 3.30. 30 with Dr. Jones. Yeah, that's what I said already. Harley Pierce, please take a seat and a nurse will come and get you once your appointment is ready. Congratulations on your change day. Um, yeah, thanks. Ugh, hate robots. Hi! Welcome to the Change Institution, a place where pets can become the best they can be. Thanks to government funding, scientists were able to create a way to give pets the thing they want most. Equality! With our new technology, the government can now give every pet the opportunity to become the perfect five they have always dreamed of. Let's take a look at one of the many thankful pets who have undergone the change. Hi, my name is Emily. Before I got the change, I was very unhappy with my body. All around me were these beautiful pets, and then me, just a nerd with bad fur. But thanks to the new law in place, I was able to go through the change and now look at me. I'm now beautiful just like all the other pets I used to envy. Thanks for sharing, Emily. We are all glad you were able to become the pet of your dreams. Mm-hmm. Sure you are. Harley Pierce. Dr. Jones will now see you. I'm Harley. Please follow me. Hmm? Oh, you must be Harley. Welcome. Please, come have a seat. Um, okay. Well, Harley, today is a very special day for you. I'd like to go over some things, then we can take a look at potential looks for your transformation. Well... Actually... Alright, well, you must be a little nervous. Everyone typically is before the procedure. However, I like to remind my patients that I have performed this operation hundreds of times and all have been complete successes. As for the procedure, it's painless. What will happen is I will give you some sedatives, you'll take a nice nap, I'll work my magic, and you'll wake up as the pet of your dreams. Well, Dr. Jones, I... Actually, oh yes, you were probably eager to see the models. If you could focus your attention over here, I'll show you the first six. <coughs> These are just some of the looks we have available for a feline like yourself. Most pets pick a look that works well with their personality, 
but some just choose whichever one they fancy most. <laughs> so, do you like any of these? If not, I can show you the second set. Dr. Jones, you seem like a great doctor, but the only reason I came here today was to tell you I don't agree with what you're doing here at your practice, and I will not be going through with the change. <laughs> I beg your pardon? I'm sorry, but I already like how I look, and I think pets should be taught to like themselves for who they are, not just come here to get fixed how they look. The government has no right to tell pets they need to change themselves just to fit the image of perfection. But Miss Pierce, this is a gift from your government. Well, tell them thank you, but I'll pass. Have a nice day, Dr. Jones. I'm sorry, Miss Pierce, but as you know, Huh? This is a gift you cannot refuse. Wait, wait, what are you, what are you, what are you doing? No, you can't make me, no. Uh. Don't worry, Harley. We will pick out a great new look for you. Have you guys seen Harley lately? Um, no, I haven't. She's been out of school for almost a week, I think. What if something went wrong with her change? Oh, what? No, that's impossible. Dr. Jones is the best transformation doctor. She's probably just taking a few days off to adjust. Guys, what if she didn't go through with it? Is that even allowed? I don't know. Harley? Guys, she... Went through with it! Look! Hey girls, so what do you think? I love it! You look amazing. Thanks. I couldn't decide on a look, so Dr. Jones picked this one out for me, and it's perfect. It really is. See, it isn't so bad. Not at all. I wish I could thank the government myself, because this has made me so much happier. See you ladies at lunch. No, no, you can't make me... <laughs> Don't worry, Harley. We'll pick out a great new look for you. <laughs> what have they done to me?